Okay. We're going to take a live look now at Interstate 270, just west of New Florissant Road, where construction is underway on the I-270 North Corridor project. Now, North St. Louis County is in the midst of a major MoDOT makeover right now, and we've been giving you an up-close and personal tour of the project all week. Yeah, our guide Alex Fees is returning now with another installment. Uh, Alex, I know that you've been looking at how this affects a stretch of Lindbergh this morning. That's right, Michelle and Rennie, thank you. That's what we're taking, uh, are focusing on this morning. You know, MoDOT officials say Interstate 270 North is one of the heaviest traveled roads in the state of Missouri with a higher crash rate due possibly to congestion, roadway design, and varying speeds. That's why MoDOT officials are redesigning and renovating this eight mile stretch of interstate in North St. Louis County. Now here's the view from Skylens 5. Before it is complete, the I-270 North project will affect at least seven major interchanges, including I-170, North Florissant, West Florissant, and Halls Ferry in between Lindbergh and 367. Project engineer Justin Wolf gave us a walking tour of the changes along the I-270 earlier this month and mapped out the changes planned at the Lindbergh interchange to improve connectivity. On, um, getting close to the southbound Lindbergh bridge over 270, we are looking to the west towards um, McDonald Boulevard. We are going to be rebuilding the ramp connection from this new alignment of Lindbergh to 270. So again, Lindbergh, um, we've separated the structure to have northbound 270 on one structure and southbound 270 on the other. We will have four signalized intersections here, and it allows us to really flush traffic through this interchange and efficiently get traffic through here. Currently, Dunn Road would basically end and you'd go on Taylor to come up to the taylor Lynn Haven interchange. With this design, we are making Dunn Road continuous. It's actually going underneath northbound Limburg. In addition to these crossings where we're building 88 facilities, we have 10 miles of multi-use path that we're building along Pershaw and Dunn Road. Now tomorrow we will take a look at the changes planned along I-270 at 170 and Halls Ferry, all aimed at improving traffic flow. Live this morning in Madison County, Alex Fees, 5 on your side. Thanks so much, Alex.